Meanwhile, the so-called Battle of Britain continues, many of the most violent encounters taking place over the cliffs of Dover and the southeast coast. The Germans attack in large numbers, and our anti-aircraft batteries, as well as our fighter pilots, continue to destroy them in large numbers. Barrage balloons naturally have quite a bad time in these parts. It's easy for a Nazi to shoot him down, they can't shoot back. But the anti-aircraft gunners can and do. Many of the enemy pilots bail out and are made prisoner. In any case, as fast as the balloons may be hit, so fast are they replaced. It's all part of the Battle of Britain. But the most vital, spectacular and brilliant part of the great aerial campaign is being played by the fighter command. Constantly in action, the Hurricanes and Spitfires refuel and rearm in preparation for the next encounter. You all know the staggering losses suffered by the Germans. Well, these are the boys who are doing the trick. Over the Straits of Dover, the Blitzkrieg is being broken by the fighter command. Nearly 2,000 enemy planes destroyed during the first year's defense of Britain. There goes one of them, a Heinkel 112. 